have a brand new piece for our Rochester audiences by a composer named Stephanie Berg, who's a very talented young American composer, uh, and her piece is called Ravish and Mayhem. The piece was inspired sort of by a Middle Eastern street festival, so it's got that festive electric energy about it, uh, and it's got a lot of great colors, some complex rhythms, a lot of trilling and things, which gives it kind of an exotic flair. And then at the end, you even hear the brass mimic elephants marching uh, through the center of the town, so you hear the elephants make an appearance as well. It's got a lot of great colors, and it's a lot of fun. We have an amazing pianist coming in, Vadim Kolodenko, who had a, one of those debuts with us last season where you know, he brought the house down. Uh, almost literally. He was the gold medal winner of the Van Cliburn competition, so obviously, you know, he's been noticed all over the world and we're really lucky to have him back here for a second time. His being a Van Cliburn winner uh, is even more significant in this concert because this is actually the piece that he was playing when he won the gold medal at the Van Cliburn competition. We have Strauss's Ein Heldenleben on the second half of the concert, which is one of my all-time favorites. He's amazing. He, the way he uses the orchestra to tell a story, um, not just in his opera, but in his tone poems. This is one of his tone poems, Ein Heldenleben. It means a hero's life or heroic life. We all start learning this piece, you know, from the moment we become serious about classical music. Uh, well, for violinists, this is like one of the standard concertmaster excerpts at, at any audition. If you're trying out to be a concertmaster, you will at some point in the process be expected to play the Heldenleben solos uh, because they're very extensive, they're very difficult technically but musically it's also you know crucial for the story um, so the relationship between the concertmaster and the conductor is very important whenever you perform this piece uh, and this will be the first time that I've done well this piece and really any extensive concertmaster solo piece with our wonderful concertmaster uh, Juliana Thade so I'm very much looking forward to that in addition to all the other wonderful things on this concert. Can I eat now? Yeah, no, I don't think it's too